Mem kupka kramanik um nu kiga maya mak nu lilak apa jam kamgam amka nem nang ampa nem nang memua inok raka kalam kala nem yak oramag yang megik That's good news nane kari maraka amkam ja uklibik memarak ne bab ja kipem guana Tell the captain that I'll be back on the bridge as soon as I've done his errand. Yes, sir. Good to have you aboard. I'm Lieutenant Silas, second in command of the Black Talon. We're your ride to Drom and Kars. Well met and all that. Indeed. Welcome. It's not a comfortable ship, but as transports go, it does its job. On our present course, we should arrive at the capital within a day. Won't be any trouble. In the meantime, your droids in the conference room. We picked it up with the upgrades from Geonosis. When we docked here, it mentioned your name. Sorry, I don't know what droid you're talking about. Oh, the machine asked for you, so I assumed you were the owner. My mistake. In any case, it seems someone wants to get in touch. The conference room is down the hall. I'll be on the bridge. And you, soldier, when you're done playing honor guard, get back to your post. This isn't a luxury yacht. Yes, sir. Identity confirmed. Good day. I'm Advanced Protocol Unit NRO2. My functions are diplomacy, translation, manslaughter, and calumniation. I have an urgent message for you from my master. Please stand by for delivery. I'm paying attention. This is Unit NRO2 to Grand Moff Kilrin. You are now in contact with a Black Talon. Well, so I am. And it seems you've brought me just the person I've been looking for. My name is Rikus Kilrin. I'm commander of the Fifth Fleet, second to the Minister of War, and my personal favorite, the so-called Butcher of Coruscant. I don't understand. What's going on here? It's apparent I need another pair of hands, so I asked NR2 to check the ship's passenger manifest. My good fortune that I was in a position to contact you. I was already aboard the Black Talon. Six hours ago, the Republic engaged in an illegal border skirmish on the edges of Imperial territory. One enemy warship escaped. That warship, the Brentle Star, is carrying a passenger of vital strategic importance. Yours is the only vessel placed to intercept. Where do I come in? I'll explain in a moment. The warship's passenger is codenamed the General. We don't know his identity, but the Republic believes he possesses military secrets, our military secrets. I trust the reports. The General must be captured or killed. Captain Orzik, the man commanding your transport, doesn't share my enthusiasm. He's disobeyed my orders to attack. Feel free to show him what the Empire does to cowards. Then commandeer his ship, find the Brentel Star, and deal with the General. Sounds interesting. But you realize, I don't work for free. I certainly understand, as will the Imperial Treasury. We need individuals like you if we're to survive the next great war. I will lead the way to the bridge. Once Captain Orsic is deposed and our hijacking is complete, we may proceed. Halt! This is a restricted area. Captain Orsic's command. You'll have to leave immediately. I suggest you back off before someone gets hurt. I'm afraid I can't do that. This is the command deck entry hatch. No one's allowed in until we reach our destination. Time is limited. We must proceed to the bridge immediately. Our orders were to treat any approach as an attack. You need to take your droid and move it. I'm stepping away. There's no need to be nervous. Our window to intercept the Brentall Star is rapidly closing. Engaging expediency measures. Blasters out! All Marines have been neutralized, scanning for additional threats. What's going on? Sir, stay calm, Ensign. Everyone stay calm. No threats found. The bridge is now secure. Who's calling the shots here? I'm Captain Revenant Orzik. I'm pretty sure I know what this is about. For the record, I take complete responsibility for my actions. I understand, Captain. If nothing else. That should make it easier on the crew. 
I'm glad it's worth something. You're here because of the moth, aren't you? You must want the Bental Star's passenger pretty badly. Or maybe he just hates me. The Black Talon would be destroyed chasing a battleship. I fought in the war before and I'll fight again, but I don't do suicide missions. I'm not looking to make a martyr of anyone. We can complete this mission and survive. I expect you believe that. I see it differently. Listen to me. You've managed to hijack one ship and that's certainly impressive. But taking on the Bental Star is something else altogether. I might be able to get us close, but then you'd have to board it, fight an army of Republic soldiers and somehow find a general. It's unacceptable. We don't have a choice. Those were Moff Kilrin's instructions. So if we're gonna survive, we need to work together. I see. You're as much a victim here as I am, aren't you? Damn Kilran and his fleet. All right. I'm not ready to be branded a traitor just yet. We'll get the general. I'm not sure how, but we'll get him. I got that covered. I'll do my best to remember that. Downloading new orders to all bridge consoles. Priority one, intercept the Brentall Star. You heard the droid, everyone. Prepare to jump to light speed. Emerging from hyperspace now. One Thranta class warship on the scanners. Powering up. Enemy is firing. Turbo lasers, missiles, and what looks like transport pods. I'm not sure. Evasive maneuvers. Keep the pods at distance. They look harmless, but they'll latch onto the hull and cut at us with sabotage droids. Evasive maneuvers. Aye, sir. Sir, three shuttles on an intercept course. An assault party. We don't have sufficient defenses to keep them from landing. Let them land. I can handle any borders. This course of action is deemed advisable. Security will meet you at the entrance of the shuttle bay. Defend the ship at all costs. Damage reports from all decks. We're holding together, sir, but I don't know for how long. Make it last, Ensign. Don't let us down. Please stand alert. Grand Moff Gilrand's representative has returned. I see you took care of the Republic assault. Welcome back to the bridge. Thank you, Captain. We've survived the first wave of attacks from the Brental Star. Things will be calm until we enter fighter range. Another minute, maybe two. Transmission coming in. Long range. It's a message, but it's not from the Brental Star. Put it through, Ensign. This is Jedi Grand Master Satil Shan hailing unidentified Imperial vessel. I'm en route to your location with 16 Republic vessels. I'm asking you to retreat before more lives are lost. Well met and all that. I'm glad to hear a voice of reason. Let us end this conflict together. The Brental Star is under my protection. Our convoy was ambushed and I sent the star ahead. We will reunite. I just crippled three Imperial Dreadnoughts. I don't wish to destroy you. The peace between Republic and Empire is fragile enough already. I don't play politics. Take it somewhere else. Even Mandalorians respect life. This isn't about politics. Incidents like this are happening across the galaxy, but only because we let them. Leave the Brentel Star to me. If you don't, then may the Force be with you. Because the men and women aboard that ship can hold you off until we arrive. And you will be defeated. We'll see about that. End transmission. Affirmative. Ending transmission. Entering fighter range. The Brentel Star is launching its first squadron. It's time for us to do the same. I assume you'll be leading the boarding party to go after the General? Whatever's necessary to finish this. There's one other thing. I promised you my help, so I brought you some supplies from the cargo bay. Someone on Drummond Cast may be disappointed when they don't receive the delivery, but I thought our situation took precedence. You're doing well, Captain. Continue when we may make it out of this. Thank you. We're all doing our best here. I advise that you proceed to the shuttle bay. The flight to the Brentall Star may be hazardous, but Grand Moff Kilran has complete faith. This is Protocol Unit NRO2. I hope you're receiving this message clearly, and that your flight was free of incident. Please hold for Security Coordinator Ensign Brukhara. The Marines are on their way. They'll follow you in and hold each junction you secure. 
Try not to take too long. We're not a military ship. What you have is all you're getting. Thanks for the heads up. I have been scanning the Brenton Star's communications, and security forces appear to be moving to protect the escape pods. It is extremely likely that the crew is attempting to evacuate the General. You must retrieve or eliminate him before he escapes. We'll have the General before the crew knows what's happening. Excellent news. I will be in contact if the situation changes. Proceed to assault all defense points between you. The escape pods aren't far now. You can make it on your own, General. And what about you? I will face my destiny. Go now, my friend. Halt where you are. I am Yadir Van, Padawan of the Jedi Order. I was sent to protect the General, and you will not pass. Surrender. Give me what I want, and your ship can survive. I cannot accept that. A Jedi does not surrender the innocent into the hands of evil. But I intend to drive you back, meter by meter if need be, just as the Republic pushed the Sith Empire into the dark of the galaxy. Then there's no way we can settle this peacefully? No. You can put aside your weapons. I won't try to run. Besides, I doubt I'd make it to an escape pod without my intestines spilling out. How did you get injured? Unlucky. Caught in your ship's attack. I'm told the wounds aren't fatal, but that doesn't help the pain. I was a general in the Imperial Military Service. Did they tell you that when they sent you here? Did they even know? Why would you betray the Empire? If you knew what I knew, you'd understand. If you'd heard what both sides are plotting, you wouldn't be eager to restart this war. They're building doomsday weapons, shields that envelop planets, missiles that darken suns. Republic and Empire are planning to raise worlds, annihilate civilizations. It will be unlike anything the galaxy's seen since the great hyperspace war. And it's too late to stop it. The so-called Peace is already lost. If that's true, why defect to the Republic? There's no place for me in the Empire anymore. I thought my last act might be to even the odds, create a stalemate. It doesn't seem to matter anymore. Oh, you have me then? Me, my stomach full of blood, and my implant full of cybernetic secrets and stolen plans. What will you do? I'm gonna bring you to my ship. From there you'll be transported to Drummond Kaas and taken into Imperial custody. Where I'll be tortured or executed, or at best, placed in a cell for the rest of my life. Still, there's nowhere in the galaxy where I could truly hide. I will follow you. Captain Orzik here. I understand you're on your way back. I assume congratulations are in order. Our Marines have been recalled to the Black Talon. As soon as your aboard will jump to light speed, Republic reinforcements could arrive at any minute. Prepare a holding cell. I'm bringing a prisoner. The General? I'm sure the droid and Grand Moff Kilrun would be pleased to have him alive. I'll see you on the bridge. Congratulations. The heroes of the day return. Welcome back, sir. My men will take the general to the brig. Congratulations. I never expected the mission to go off this cleanly. I'm glad to see you're so happy. What's not to be pleased about? You spared my life, and we eliminated an enemy of the Empire. Grand Moff Kilrin is eagerly awaiting your report. Should I put him through? It's your command again. Make the call. Put the Grand Moth through. Opening channel now. Well, 
How fortunate I could reach my friends aboard the Black Talon. The droid's been keeping me appraised of your work, but I very much wanted to hear from you. How did the attack go? The Brentel Star has been disabled and the General captured. He'll be in your hands soon. Excellent. I'll let Korriban and Imperial Intelligence fight over him. You should be proud. This is only one of the many operations we're conducting across the galaxy. It's a new beginning to the war. The General was one of the greatest weapons the Republic had. A defector. And you've snatched him from enemy hands. I'll remember this. And I'll make sure you're rewarded. No trouble. This is how I make my living. Of course. And the Empire can always use more dedicated mercenaries. But my words hardly matter. Soon you'll be joining us on the homeworld, and you can see for yourself what you've been fighting for. It should be inspiring. Enjoy the rest of your journey. Kilrun out. <laughs>